One time I was feeding the chickens food and then I was holding the bucket up and then one just flew up and then over the cage. The phrase up with the chickens might make most people cringe, but not six-year-old London Tavarich. In the morning, if I have time, I come out and I get the eggs and I make sure everybody's out of their cage. Before school, she'll make sure uh, the chickens are up and out of the coop in their run. Um, sometimes she'll run over and catch the eggs if it's early or if we have enough time in our, our morning start. Um, when she gets home from school, she goes right to the eggs. She puts them in her box to sell them. Um, on the weekends, we clean coops and we um, freshen everything up and she, she's involved in every bit of it. Um, during the week, she helps me get the feed and goes to the tractor supply and then we let her keep all the funds from all her hard work. At the age of three, she and her dad took a ride so she could help take care of her dog. The rest is history. So uh, I was working, I just had started working from home and London and her dad went to Tractor Supply to get dog food. And they came in the house and they had a little box that was chirpy. <laughs> so um, London said she wanted to take full responsibility for the chickens um, because we tried it with the dog and the responsibility thing. So she started it and she said she wanted to sell the eggs and um, it grew. We started with a small coop for six chickens, and now we have Chicken Paradise. They're very interesting. They're very cute. And the are very silly. The family's home in Newton Falls is at the intersection of Route 5 and 534, and it has literally become a paradise for all sorts of little chicks who lay a variety of eggs. This little lady has big goals thanks to her growing small business. The goal is when I'm 16, I am gonna go on a trip to Paris. That sounds great. What, what about Paris? Why do you like Paris? Because I love Frenchie and her name's Paris, and I really want to go to see the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> That's a beautiful thing. So London takes the eggs, she'll put them in her carton, she'll put them up front. Um, she sells them two for five dollars, or two dozen for five dollars. Three dollars per dozen. Um, there's a money box in her, her chicken box, and um, they just come by, they grab what they want and they put the money in the box. Sometimes they leave us cartons. Um, I did recently, we put our phone number on there so they can do special orders, and we've had a few lately. So we're, she's actually donating uh, eight dozen this week to a charity for uh, an Easter Bunny event. On this day, my Sabina had a front row view of what it means to take care of more than just a few dogs. And on this day, we all took a moment to appreciate a little girl's excellent efforts to achieve her big dreams. I'm proud. She, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> she works very hard for six. Like, I, this was not me at six. So, we're proud of her. She does a great job with school. Here at home, she's very helpful. She loves all of her animals. She has a horse that she's very passionate about. Um, she goes to there on the weekends and takes care of him and she never complains and she reaps the rewards, so.